heart. This is the fabric that came from my bride's father's shirt. I'm going to take a plain piece of paper to make a pattern for our heart. I'm going to take my paper and fold it in half. And I'm just going to freehand my version of a heart. This is the grade school way of making a heart. And I'm going to cut it out a little bigger than I really need it. Now I'll open it up. And there we have a heart. And I'm going to place my heart on the wrong side. Because I'm going to chalk it out and I don't want my chalk to show. So I'm going to chalk out my heart. And now as you can see, I have the imprint of my heart. Now to cut this out, I'm going to leave about a half an inch all the way around my heart. Now that that's cut out, what you want to do now, because there's this is a no-sew project. So we're going to take a nice pair of good sharp clipping scissors and you're going to clip you're going to clip right to the chalk line you can also do this with snips you're just going to snip right to the chalk line and you're going to do this all the way around the entire heart now I finished clipping all the edges all the way around my heart when I got to the center portion I made sure that my clip came down into the middle and when I got to the end portion, I made sure my clip came down to the point. So now what you'll do is you'll take each piece and fold it in just like that. And we're going to press these little tips down so that we make the imprint of the heart. Pressing the um, little tips on the inside or the wrong side of the fabric. As you see, I have pressed the pieces and they're not completely pr pressed flat, but that will give you an idea of where you're going to start stitching so when you start to stitch your heart you would tuck this in and you would just whip stitch whip stitch it around to give you the nice heart shape now to show you the second way of making this beautiful keepsake something blue heart 